I myself am a dream. I can say this as a sense that my psyche, the psyche, is dreaming all the time. The notion or sense of I myself a dream is really an invitation to the world of images and seeing symbolically. Mythoetically speaking, it's like stepping through the doorway into the imaginal, to the light that illuminates images from within its own darkness, like the black sun. Seeing myself as a dreaming process is a new and ancient way of seeing or being. I'm Susanna Rubstad. I'm an art therapist and clinical supervisor and uh, counselor and a faculty member at City University. I'd like to invite you to follow this process of I myself am a dream. For example, if we were to take the perspective that our life and all the characters and encounters we experience are dreaming processes, how might this affect us? Any person in our waking life may carry hints of what is often hidden from us, an inner dynamic that is dreaming us, just as we can carry their deep dreaming processes. We may ask, what are the figures behind the figures, these inner and outer processes that live mostly in the unconscious and are powerful parts of the dynamic of our intrapsychic landscape? Knowing I myself am a dream allows me to see the, my experience as a mirror of the myth that is living through me. What would that be like for you? Who is here in the waking world in your life that walks and talks the inner journey? What do these living images inform us of? The people around us, the people we live with, the people we meet on the street. These are also dreaming processes. What stories and encounters do they ignite within us? I myself am a dream is also a way of seeing relationships as mirrors. We could take a relationship or life scenario and do dream work with it, for example. We could look for paradoxical figures or situations where polarity often is what is considered the problem or obstacle or conflict. And this could present itself in the dynamic through which we can gain access to the transcendent function, according to Jung. I myself also a dream explores the unlived life. What are we dreaming that's telling us of parts of ourselves we don't know very well? I myself am a dream creates access to the child archetype, a primary archetype which endlessly has innovative energy that moves us from the past into the present and into the future, moving the dream forward. The courage and resilience of the child archetype keeps us leaning towards learning and growth. I myself as a dream is also connected to Eros, Logos, Mythos, and Chaos. These have been human dreaming processes that have been cultivated over millennia and take us into the collective, the archetypal. So moving the dream forward, where do I go? We can explore our experience more deeply, more collectively, and more personally when we say, I myself am a dream and even recognize polyvagal responses such as fight, fight, flee, freeze, as moments of transformation, if these are dreaming processes. And finally, who is the dreamer? I invite you to join us in this process of exploring I myself and the dream. Thank you.